they fucking good. Did your hood show you love? Did the hoes say you fly? If your friends say you loyal, you throw your worldies in the sky for the trust. Hey, what's up you guys? It is your boy Sparks here coming to you with another Call of Duty Mobile video for you guys today. And today, today, we're looking at my very first nuclear and Call of Duty Mobile. I was about to say Black Ops 4, god damn it. But uh, today is the my first ever nuclear in black and freaking you see what I mean? In Call of Mobile, my lord. And um, I'm in the in the gameplay in the background, we are playing some domination. On Nuketown, I'm playing. This is actually I'm playing with my buddies here. Okay, we're playing with my first time ever playing with him. You guys may have known him on the channel, or you may see him in the comment section down below. Playing with some Echo India or Jimmy, I like to call him Jimmy. Playing with your boy Bachi, all right, or Enrique, and we're playing with with, with your boy Grunt, all right. We're playing with your boy Grunt on here. We're playing, you know, chilling, you know, having a good good night on COD Mobile. And um, I, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. I did not even know I even dropped a, a, a nuclear in this game. I really did not. Um, as you can see, I'm shredding. You know, playing domination. You know, we're communicating. You know, throwing UAVs up here, throwing UAVs up there, um, and I go off. Um, obviously, uh, in this game, you can get a nuclear either by getting 30 kills with your gun, or by just getting 30 kills in overall without dying. Um, I actually did that. I did the second one. I did 30 kills without dying with my kill streaks. Um, in this gameplay, I'm using UAV, care package, and the uh, Hellstorm missile or the Predator missile, whatever. And um, in my care package, I think either in the first or second round, I call in the Veto warship. And that thing, I'd even, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I didn't even know kill streaks even counted towards like a nuclear streak. I didn't even know that. I didn't know that until looking back into this gameplay. But I, I called in that Veto warship, and I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I just literally just sat there and I just spawn trapped the living hell out of it. This was frontline. Alright, if you guys know what frontline is, you always spawn in your spawn and you always have the inv invincibility when you guys spawn in. This is frontline, I, I, I'll be pissed off. But no, this is some domination, you know. And I, I don't even know what to tell you guys. Like, I was just running around the map, I was just chilling, you know. We were just ch talking. Um, oddly enough, when I do record, you know, off my iPhone, because I am recording off my iPhone, you know, the whole system built in, whatever. Um, it records everyone else's voices, but sadly, it doesn't record mine, even if I put my microphone on. And you can see in the gameplay my microphone is on, it's just you can't hear me talk, sadly. But, um, yeah, it's pretty much, I mean, either way, like, you, you really wouldn't hear me get freaked out because I didn't even know, I did not even know I, um, got the tactical, no, not the tactical, but the nuclear in here. And as you can see, I got the VTOL warship, and I think I call in, yeah, the Predator missile, and I'm just like, alright, let me, let me get these couple kills right here, alright, let me get this here. And this is, I, as soon as I get the veto worship, I don't care if we're losing, I don't care if we're, like, we're five points away from losing, I always call it in because you never know. And this is why I go ham. I'm literally spawn trapping. This thing can get you so many kills in such a little time. And like I said, I really don't know if there's, like, any rockets. I'm just looking at the gameplay again. I don't think there's any, like, rockets like how it is in Black Ops 2 with the veto worship. It's literally just the Gatling guns. But this thing absolutely shreds. And, um... It, yeah, look at this. I'm literally just spawn trapping them, you know, and I didn't know like this actually counted towards a nuclear streak But hey, hey first nuclear man and how I how I came about this is that you know I was just on the game, you know I was just at work and I was just like oh, let me just open up the game and just do like my daily, you know You know do my daily check in whatever right and I need to see and I went to go see my medals You know I was just like I need to just check out my medals because everyone wants to know their medals and everyone wants to see this and that And I'm like alright cool, let me just go check out my medals and I see I have a nuclear and I was just like um, yeah, where's my, um, I don't remember dropping a nuclear, I don't remember that at all, and I was like, I have to go, I have to go and find it, and, um, I, it's actually right here, so I think I get a kill, like, right here, is it right here, it's like right here, boom, you see it on the screen, nuclear, and then I die, as soon as I get it, I, uh, how amazing is that, I was one off, I mean, at least I got the last kill, with, with, you know, a gun, but, you know, the last kill, I got the nuclear, and then I died, so I couldn't go on unstoppable. But, you know, I was looking through my medals, and I was just like, I need to find the game. And I told myself, I was like, man, I was going through all my gameplays on my phone. I was like, man, I wish, you know, there was like a way you can check, you know, your past gameplays. And ho holly dooly, holly day, man. I, I looked through it, and I was just like, this game really does have it. You can look back through your games. It tells you the day you played them. It looks like, uh, it tells you, like, the score and the kills you got and your medals. And I was like, this is the game. 
and I actually found this gameplay. Uh, I was gonna roll that. So I, th I think that's another perk you can add that I forgot to mention during the first impressions and review on Cloud Mobile. You can literally go back and check it out. Um, I th do we win this game? I don't remember. Even though I dropped the nuclear and I call in a veto, I actually don't remember. It's uh, it, this game is literally all about like if, if you can hold B, you win the game on Nuketown, pretty much. And that's how it is on console. If you, and if you're playing on console Nuketown, if you can hold B, you know you win the game. You know, but you know we're trying our best here, and I think we make it close. I don't think we actually win. I think we do lose, maybe like one or two points we lose. But hey, that's just how it is. Um, yeah, but that's my first um, nuclear in this game, guys. Um, many more to come. I don't know if I can ever go on a streak like that ever again. I mean, it's just it is what it is. But I don't know if I ever can. Actually, hey, we actually won. I didn't actually know that. Uh, wow, I doubted myself. But we actually won the game. Um, but you know. Make sure to leave a like. The video ends. It's going to be ending right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like. Subscribe for more content. Well, it's 550 subscribers and 600 subscribers. Turn on those post notifications. And I'll see you guys in the very next video. Peace out.